everybody, and welcome back to another one. And, um, if my voice sounds very, very low, and y'all can't hear me, sorry, I'm tired, I just got back from, um, trick or treating because today is Halloween, but I'm gonna try my best to get two reactions out today, well, last night, at the time recording this, 9.36pm at night, October 31st, Halloween, uh, happy November, happy new month. But, um, I need to get to this video, and I haven't reacted to an old ass small movie in a good little bit. So, anyways, guys, if you do enjoy this video, be sure to give it a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, let me go get something. And I also gotta do an update. And I know this setup looks really weird, but I've been moving around a lot to, like, make my videos look more unique and stuff. So, yeah. Sorry, guys. I'm so thirsty and so low energy right now. I need to choose some gum. Alright, let's go. Pinch! Ow, why'd you pinch me? Because, Marvin, you're not wearing green, and it's St. Patrick's Day, so I get to pinch- St. Patrick's Day special? I thought so. It is called the pod goal. Issue. I hate this stupid holiday. Hey, you know it? Pinch. Ow! Why'd you pinch me, you dick? Because you're not wearing green. Marvin, you can't do that. Why not? Because, Marvin, you're not wearing green. You have to be wearing green in order to pinch someone who's not wearing green. I didn't know there were so many rules to this. Yeah, Dad, you're not wearing green. <laughs> Ow! You're not supposed to hit me. You're supposed to pinch me. April Fool's. It's not the same holiday. <sighs> Who's at the door? Hello? Hey there, pinch police. Pinch police? He's not wearing green! Pinch him! Oh my god, stop pinching me! Take that, you little bitch! Oh, stop it! That's what you get for not wearing green! Like, why are you pinching me? Well, because we're the pinch police. Okay, well, what does that even mean? It means we pinch you if you don't wear green. Okay, well, you already pinched me, so stop! Well, now we have probable cause, so we have to come in and make sure everybody else in there is wearing green. Well, that's not probable cause! Alright, is everybody wearing green in here? I am! I am! But, baby, you gave him green beads to wear! Yeah, Marvin, so he wouldn't get pinched! Well, Marvin, looks like you're the only one not wearing green, so I'm gonna pinch the shit out of you! Well, no, 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 stop, 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 Hey, this is my favorite day. I love pinching people for not wearing a certain color. Why? Well, I think I got addicted to it in high school. Oh, no. You're going to tell me an animated story, aren't you? You bet I am. Settle in. It's a long one. So I was in high school, and it was St. Patrick's Day, and I was wearing all the green. Green pants, green shirt, green shoes, green hat, everything. I even ate green snow cones so my shit would be green. No one was pinching me that day, except this kid named Diddly. He pinched me even though I was wearing green, but I just punched him in the face. Anyway, I was in class pinching any kid that wasn't wearing green, and they could couldn't say shit because no, it's not. See that pimple? No, they weren't wearing green and I caught them. So after I was done pinching the whole class, I saw the perfect victim, Mrs. Thickums, my sex ed teacher. She had the fattest ass. I'm talking a huge dumpy. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall and the wall was her ass. Everyone in school wanted to know if it was firm or juicy. And I noticed she wasn't wearing green and I thought, today's the day I finally find out what Mrs. Thickums ass feels like. What? She was handing out tests from last week and when she got to my desk, I looked her up and down to make sure she wasn't wearing green and she wasn't, so I pinched the hell out of her ass, and it felt like jello. I pinched it a few more times, and I even gave it a smack, and then she turned around and yelled, Brooklyn guy, principal's office, now! And I said, but Mrs. Thickums, you aren't wearing green, and you're double caked up on a Tuesday. So she said, I am wearing green, and she pulled down her pants and showed me her green thong. And man, I wasn't even mad I got suspended for two weeks. That was the greatest day of my life. But Mrs. Thickums did get arrested for mooning the whole class. Yeah, and ever since that day, I haven't washed my hand. Ew! Hey, you didn't see Mrs. Thickums' ass. And besides, how dirty can my hand really be? Smell it, Simmons. <laughs> Smells like ass, mate. But I don't know if it's yours or Miss Thickums. Hmm, maybe both. Can you guys please leave now? Wow, how incredibly rude. Kicking two police officers out of your house just because they pinched you a lot. Exactly, yeah. I don't want you pinching me and you need to leave. Wait, hold on. Everybody shut up. The news is on. <laughs> news, okay. A leprechaun is claiming that he left a pot of gold in the woods for anyone to find. Let's go to the interview now. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with the leprechaun. So tell me, leprechaun, what is your name? Oh, my name's Scotty Pippin. Scotty Pippin the leprechaun, everybody. So tell me, what's with the pot of gold? Well, you know, I hid me pot of gold in the woods for people to find for St. Patrick's Day, being that it's my favorite holiday and whatnot. So whoever finds it first gets to keep it. So how much would you say the pot of gold is worth? Oh, not too much. Maybe two or three million dollars. And if I find it, I get to keep it? Well, of course you can, if you find it first. 
Look, Simmons, a pot of gold. I could use a pot of gold. That would make me really rich. Come on, Simmons. Wait, baby, we should go look for that pot of gold. Aw, Marvin, it's hot outside. And everyone's going to look for it, and I don't want to do that. Jeffy, you want to go look for a pot of gold? Sure, Daddy. All You're right. going to leave me here by myself? Yeah, come on, Jeffy, let's go. <laughs> guys, guys, guys! You're going to leave me here by myself? Yeah. Oh, Jenny, are you that excited about playing the game of life? Yeah, dude, it's just a board game. No, guys, I just saw on the news there's this leprechaun who hid his gold in the woods. What? Yeah, there's a leprechaun on the news. He said he hid his gold in the woods for anyone to find. Oh, oh dude, I want to find it. Guys, this sounds like a scam. It's not a scam, Cody. He was a real leprechaun on the news. They interviewed him, and he said he left his gold in the woods worth millions of dollars, and anyone who finds it first gets to keep it. There's no way there's a pot of gold in the woods. Come look for it, Cody. Come on. All right, buddy, how we find this pot of gold? We're going to go to the woods, and then you take one area of the woods, and I take the other. Simmons, we're not just going to go look for the pot of gold. Oh, darn, mate. I thought that'd be fun. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to find that gold by cheating. We're going to kidnap that leprechaun and torture him until he tells us where the gold is. Oh, that's way more fun. But where do we find this leprechaun? Well, you know, at his house, the only leprechaun house in town. Oh, that's right, mate. All those domestic violence calls of the leprechaun beating his leprechaun wife. Yeah, exactly. Come on. Ugh, I hate the woods. Chives, if a single leaf hits me in the face, I'm going to beat you with this stick I found. Very well. Right this way, sir. Oh, sorry, sir. Chives, come here. Mm, do I have... Find me my gold, you old fuck! I'm going to do my best, sir. All right, Jeffy, let's find this pot of gold. I don't want to know where the gold at. I want the gold. I want the gold, too, Jeffy. I wonder if it's in this tree. <laughs> Wait, it's not going to be in a tree. Oh, I got a wasp dust. Oh, there's a wasp all over me. Oh, I got a gay stuff. Oh, it hurts so goddamn bad. Well, you're handling that well. Ah! I'm going to go look for the gold, Daddy. Oh, my God, it's not the wasp. All right, guys, let's find that gold. Guys, we're never going to find it. Dude, it's going to be easy. All you got to do is look for the big red X. That's buried treasure. Wait, you don't think it's buried? No, I don't even think it exists. I think this is one big hoax. It's not a big hoax. The whole world is looking for it, and they said it's in this woods. Well, it could be anywhere in the woods. This woods is thousands of acres. Wait, Winnie the Pooh lives here? No, that's 100-acre wood. Oh. Well, I wish we were birds. We could fly over the forest, and we could easily find that treasure. Yeah, it'd be way easier, dude. Or I wish Kobe Bryant was still alive. We could use his helicopter. I know. He would be so helpful right now. Wait, you just want his helicopter, not Kobe? Well, I don't want his pilot. Yeah, his pilot was ass. Wait, yeah. Kobe's not the only person who owns a helicopter. That's not even what he was most known for. Guys, I got an idea. What? Cody, Cody, come here, come here, come here. Okay. Uh, what the hell are you guys doing? All right, Cody, we're holding the tree down. You go on the end of it, and then when you sit on it, we're going to let go of the tree. It's going to launch you across the forest so you can see where the gold is. Well, I'm not doing that. Come on, Cody, we're already holding the tree down. Go. No. Why? Because what goes up must come down, and I'm going to fall and break my neck or something. You're not going to fall and break your neck. The worst case scenario is you fall into the bucket of gold. That would still kill me. Cody, get on the goddamn tree. No. Do it for Kobe. Okay, fine, I'll do it for Kobe. Yeah. Like this? Yeah. All right. Sorry, Joseph. On the count to three, we're going to let it go, all right? All right. All right, Cody, when we count to five, we're going to let it go. Okay. One, two, three. Ah! <laughs> oh, what are you doing to me? Shut up. Where's the gold? I already told everyone. I hid me gold in the woods. Where in the woods? Well, if I told you where I hid me gold, then it would just ruin the whole point of me hiding it in the first place. Simmons, put the washcloth on his face. The washcloth? You gonna talk? All right. Okay, fine. I'll tell you where I hid the map to me gold. I hid the map in me hat. In your hat? Yeah. See. In me hat. There's paper in here. Hold on. Let me see. What? It's just a picture of a middle finger. Simmons, give him the cloth again. <laughs> you ready to talk now? Okay, fine. I'll tell you. I'll tell you where I hid the real map to me gold. It's in me sleeve. In the sleeve? Okay, yeah. what's this? It's in me sleeve! What? Oh, oh, you think this is funny, huh? You think this is a joke? Let's do it again! Okay, where's the gold? Listen, I'll take you to me gold. Just bring me to the woods, I'll show you where it is. Okay, come on. Get All right, Scotty, if you don't want to end up like JFK, you'll show us where the gold is. Me gold? Where's me gold? Uh, me gold's right here. My gold's right here under this tree stump. Wait, under the tree stump? Yes, of course. Of course me gold's under the tree stump because uh, I buried it right under here. Wait, you buried it under a tree stump? Of course I did. You just gotta dig for it. Okay, I guess I have to put my gun down. You better not go anywhere, Scotty. Oh, I wouldn't dream of it. Come on, Simmons, help me dig. Man, this sucks digging with our hands like this. Oh, no, I'm getting dirt underneath my fingernails. God, I wish we brought shovels. Man, this sucks. Scotty, can you help us dig? Wait, Scotty? What? Oh, God damn it! Let's get him, Simmons! Oh, help! 
Help! They're after me, Lucky Charm! God damn it, Simmons, where did he go? I don't know, mate. I guess we lost him. Let's go back and start digging. Maybe he wasn't lying. He must have known we were going to kill him once we got the gold. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, time for my well-deserved water break. Uh, it's so hot out here. Sir, may I please have a sip? No, who's more important, me or you? Well, I am much older than you, so it's very important that I stay hydrated. Exactly. You're older, so your body already knows how to regulate itself. Me, I don't know what I'm doing. Ew! Is this Aquafina? This is poor people water! No, sir, please! I can have some of that! No, Chives, you don't want this. This is poor people water. All right, now let's go find my gold. Very well, sir. Man, I'm gonna need a manicure after this. Simmons, we've dug so far deep, I'm starting to see Chinese sweatshops. I don't think there's gold down there. Well, where do you think it is? I don't know. Let's look somewhere else. <laughs> look, sir! I found a port! Move out of my way, Chives! What the hell is this? It would appear to be a pot of Lucky Charms. I know what it is, Chimes. Where's my gold? Maybe the gold is underneath the Lucky Charms, sir. Good thinking, Chives. Nobody move. I'll shoot. What the hell are you doing here? We're also looking for the gold. Well, the only thing we found so far is a pot of Lucky Charms. Well, maybe the gold is under the Lucky Charms. Let me put my gun down so I can eat it. Yeah, everyone eat the Lucky Charms. Now I have the gun! Nobody move! Ah, oh, rats! I gotta stop putting my gun down. All right, Chives, pick up the pot. Let's get out of here. Stay put! Damn it, Simmons! Oh. I am so sorry, Cody. I really thought you were gonna be launched across the whole forest. I broke every bone in my body. Okay, I have a question. Don't get mad. While you were up there, did you see where the gold was? No! I'm never doing anything with you guys ever again! Okay, but do you still want to play the game of life? <sighs> yes, but you'll have to spin for me. Okay. I didn't attach it to the board. Mm. Oh my god, Marvin, are you okay? No, I got stung by like 30 wasps and I think a bat. I'm so sorry, Marvin, but hey, did you ever find that pot of gold? No, I, I didn't get to look for it because I got stung. Hey, gang, I found your pot of gold. You found the gold, Jimmy, we're rich. Yeah, but I think it's chocolate because it says it on the bottom. But chocolate? Oh, I see you found me, chocolate. You had the whole world looking for a pot of chocolate? Of course, it's me finest gold chocolate bars. Thank you for doing that, Jeffy. I, I will have some of the chocolate. All right, Chives, dump it out. I want to see my gold. Very well, sir. Where's my gold? It would seem that it's just lucky charm, sir. Spanking with a mallet time. Oh. Hey guys, Can it's Logan. Well, actually, this video is 12 minutes. It might be an SMR question. Nope. Alright. I'm sorry I didn't say much in this video. Like I said, I'm tired. Jeez. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy, be sure to give this video a like. Subscribe.